So a summary of measuring voltage and current in a series circuit. So measuring voltage in a series circuit, we built this circuit here with two bulbs connected to three cells, making a roughly a, a kind of 4.5 volt battery, but it depended upon uh, how much it had been used, what the voltage was. So voltage is the energy that is supplied to charges in a circuit. So the charges that are coming through this battery are supplied with a certain amount of energy at this point here. They come round into that bulb and some of that energy is given up into light energy. That's why the bulb lights up. So it loses a certain amount of energy here. We measured that energy as being 1.21 volts, just as an example. It uh, then comes through here and more of that energy is used up in this second bulb as light energy. So we can call that what, roughly 1.56 volts. It then comes back round to the battery and is supplied with that energy again. So the amount of energy that, that is supplied to the charges in the battery is equal to the sum of these voltages across these components. So that's why we can say V3 is equal to V1 plus V2. So what we decided was the voltage in a series circuit is split up across the components. So if you take the voltage across however many components there are in a series circuit and add them up, you'll get the voltage that is coming out of the battery, the energy that is supplied to the charges coming out of the battery. If we move on to current in a series circuit, Measuring current in a series circuit built the same circuit, but instead of putting voltmeters in it, we put ammeters in it to measure what the current was at various points. So we've got a current I1 here, I2 here, and I3 here. So three different points we took the current at. We found that the current was the same at all points, so 0.16 roughly. Again, that depended upon how much the batteries had been used, how much electrical current you had. So we can say that I1 is equal to I2, which is equal to I3. And in summary, we can say that the current in a series circuit is the same at all points. Current will only change if it's got more than one direction in which it can go. In a series circuit, there's only one single loop of wire, so the current doesn't change. It's the same at all points. So voltage split up across the components, add them together to get the voltage across the battery. Current, same at all points in a series circuit.